so good morning and welcome back to the channel pick the worst time to do this because Hank is about to jump in the car and be annoyed but we are headed to Knoxville it is my birthday tomorrow so it's March 3rd my birthday is on the 4th only day of the year that gives a command so uh, we're headed to Knoxville um, to I don't know I've never been to Knoxville I see some things do some things and of course eat very well what can you not get in yeah. oh anyway headed to Knoxville Passenger princess is very demanding right now. Anyway. A clean seat is a ridiculous demand. <laughs> the fact that some of y'all like Jesse is amazing to me. Also, look at my nails. They're very 90s, like neon. Anyway, uh, I get distracted. So, headed to Knoxville. There's this really cool hotel that we're going to stay at called the Oliver. I cannot wait to show you. Um, <laughs> God, you're so distracting. He keeps going, please, sir, can I have some more? Uh, well, it's a really cool old hotel. I have to tell you the history when we get there, uh, mainly because I hadn't looked it up in depth yet. So, <laughs> but I will. I know it was. I'm not even gonna lie because I think I'm gonna say it wrong but I think it was like an old warehouse because it kind of looks like it but it has very uh cool speakeasy vibes and actually it has Knoxville's only speakeasy so you know I'm gonna be about that also lips are looking nice and pink thank god I was so nervous when they were starting to heal but anyways 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 let's get on the road it'll take us like five hours almost exactly like four hours 55 minutes so five hours um yeah Let's just go. Knoxville, Tennessee. Never been. Hope it's cool. So this is at least the first room. So we couldn't get the tub for the whole time that we're going to be here so we're going to check into that tomorrow but this room beautiful i believe this is the queen room so as you know cue the room tour <laughs> So, park the car, we're down, got the cooler with all the drinks, but <laughs> we parked at the promenade parking spot because it's free on the weekends, and max is out at seven bucks a day, I think, or, oh, well, it's 12 now, but still, the valet would have been, what, 20 bucks, 26, 26, 27 a day, so we're gonna leave it there, it looks pretty safe, so now we're headed back, whew, up this hill. So maybe get a drink. All right, so we sat and we chilled, and now there's a speakeasy downstairs that we want to go see. So have a cocktail. I feel like maybe I'm gonna break my Lent like a little bit early because the drinks look delicious, and there's one drink down there that I definitely want. So let's uh let's head downstairs.
Martinez. Hank got the Vukovi, which is, I'm not gonna try to pronounce that, cognac, rye, antica formula, Benedictine. Oh, Peychaud's bitters, I can say that. Peychaud and Angostura bitters. Is it good? Do you like it? Should I taste it? No, let me try it. It has rye in it though, so I know I won't like it. Is that for me? Oh, the back orange is still. Oh, there you go. But mine, my Martinez. Can't handle it. I really, I really like mine now. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Got the Madame Morble, which is Castle and Key Rye, Cochi Americano, Apricot Liquor, Liquor Strega, <laughs> Honey Bitters, and Sage. Sage. So, is it good? Would I like it? I don't know. I don't like that. That is. Oh yeah, because there's rye in it. But like you can't even, like you don't even taste the rye. I can taste the rye. I think it's different when you don't like it. So I got the Pisco Sour, which is Pisco, lemon, lime, some syrup, and a syrup bear, it's nut like, and egg white. It's beautiful. Yeah, I definitely understand that. Though. This is more my speed. That's just not for me. It's beautiful. All right, so we went and got some drinks. Too many, because I figured I'd come off Lent a day early. It's fun, it's fun, it's holiday. <gasps> Aw, Jesse. I mean, I got some deviled eggs, but Jesse done knocked them all about. Now they all messed up. So I got that. I also got uh, beets and blue, but I did it without the blue cheese, so. Let me show you my little salad. These eggs that Jesse uh, messed up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm trying his stuff. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> So, easy. We're gonna sit here, enjoy a chill night, and uh, enjoy our food. And we will see you <laughs> in the morning. Also, wait, we got a drink. What'd you get, Jess? The red with envy. Red with envy. I think it has bourbon. It's Angel's Envy bourbon, <sighs> um, blood orange. The smell of that smelled terrible, so I'm not gonna try that. Let me try mine, though. Uh, I forgot what was in mine, but it had gin in it, so. Mm. Ooh, delicious. And a beautiful glass. So, we're going to sit here, take a nice slow night, and chill in this bed. So, I'll see y'all in the morning. Good morning. It's my birthday morning, so 
We are walking to Starbucks to get my freebie drink. I'm gonna get a venti. It's the only time I will ever get a venti from Starbucks because it's free dollars. But we're walking down. How many? Oh, it's a bird. I don't even know what the square is. Uh, it's Market Square. Market Square. And there's a lot of restaurants. So I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do tomorrow. Ooh, I saw proper popcorn. It's good. Figure out what I'm gonna do tomorrow because Hank has to work. He took off today for my birthday, but he has to work tomorrow. So I get to explore by myself. You gonna miss me? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm under no duress. Jesse's trying to slander Peyton Manning the whole time we're here. So, on our way back, finally found a Starbucks that I get my freebie, venti, strawberry, acai lemonade. So, we're stopping at the World's Fair Park. This in, what was it, 80? I feel like it was like 85. Um, shout out, 85. <laughs> But uh, the World's Fair was around here, so like there's just giant whatever that thing is up there. So I don't know what that is, but World's Fair was over here. It's pretty cool. It's a nice little park. It's not as big as I thought it would be, actually. So right as we came back, the room was ready. So perfect. So I was like, after that walk, we got a little sweaty. It's like, it'd be amazing if I could just come back, shower in our new room and take a bath. So let me show you this new room because gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. So you, you know, you know what's coming. Cue the room tour. <laughs> Thank you. 
as you've seen, this room is gorgeous. Gorgeous light, beautiful room. Crazy tall ceilings, very happy. I feel like the ceilings in here are taller, which is weird because we're still on the same floor. I know, but we were, that's what I'm saying, we we're on the same floor as the other one. Beautiful. Very New Orleans feeling, you know? Because they have these really cool, like, plantation shutters. Oh, trying to do it with the camera. So, love that. So, you get your water. Yeah, put your uh, soda in the fridge. You're welcome. So yeah, also, as you would have seen, I love that this is where um, the robes and things are. Oh, that's how you open it. <laughs> I just yanked it open. Give you get a little push. All right, so saying goodbye to this room, I had to do one more look through, which good thing, because I forgot my tripod, but this room was beautiful. This room is beautiful. The other room is basically the same, just gigantic with the tub, which is what I want, so. My room did us good for a night, right, Jess? Yep. So now that we're settled, we stopped at a uh, Raisin Cane's and got some chicken wings. And here, are tenders. I don't know why I keep saying wings and chicken tenders. And got a uh, some tendies. And I've heard good things about the sauce, the tank tank sauce. Blah, blah, blah. The cane sauce. So I got a cane sauce. I assume that's the honey mustard because yeah. I know you don't want that. Oh, 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 boy. I'm making a mess in this room. And we just got in here. Let me try this. <laughs> Let me try the cane sauce. Mmm. Hmm. Mmm, mm, good. I don't know if you'll like it, but it's delicious. It's weird because it's like 40 cents for each sauce you get. But at least you get a decent ramekin of sauce, so. That honey mustard, my honey mustard girl, man, delicious. So we're gonna eat, chill because we did a lot of walking this morning, and uh, enjoy our room. All right, so got dressed, as you can tell, changed clothes. We chilled hard and put on some uh, perfume. This one is honestly, it smells like clean laundry. It smells so good. It's called Paisley Cologne. I'm not sure how you pronounce that, but I like to say it's Trumpier because I refuse to call it something else that sounds like someone else. So, anyway, so I usually walk away once I do that. Anyway, so Jesse found this really cool Asian place that we're going to go get some food at. And I don't know, we're gonna get some dessert somewhere. Hopefully either ice cream, because there's an ice cream place that's down the road, or there's a waffle place that's right here. So let's go get some food now that we've been sufficiently lazy. Japanese 75. That's in here. Roku Gin, Uzu Juice, Champagne. Champagne. Again. That's delicious. You should try that. What'd you get? Oh, you got like a Japanese old fashioned, basically. Then we got some goiza. We got some goiza, we got some JFC, which I guess is like Korean fried chicken. So is that Japanese fried chicken? Gotcha. And then you got some short ribs. Short ribs. Excited.
So, stopped and got some ice cream. I got the Dolce with the hard shell. It's delicious. Let me try your Dole Whip. Jesse got the Dole Whip milkshake. Mango Dole Whip. You know what it tastes like? Like a fruit roll up. He got mango Dole Whip. Oh, it's delicious. Now we gotta grab something from the car, but then we're just gonna go back to the hotel. It is hella messy, but it's delicious. So we're back. Uh, I have to take off the shirt because I got literal ice cream all over my shirt and my shoes, but we're gonna use this bathtub. I'm so excited to get in this bathtub because I mean, our other room was great. It was absolutely great, but this tub needs to be used. So I need to take off this makeup, get in the shower because I cannot, <laughs> I cannot get in the bathtub without taking a shower first. Just the fact of being dirty sitting in the bathtub is gross to me. So operation defunct and then tub. I'll say y'all this robe it's nice it's like the thickest like like towel feels good now I'm ready to just be in this tub so ready it always takes forever to fill up a tub but worth it y'all that bath was so nice it was very nice I was literally falling asleep in there. So I was like, I gotta get up out of here because I can't be falling asleep in the bathtub. So now I need to go get Hank because I know for a fact that he's out there sleeping because it's 11.40. I hear him, I think he woke up. Anyway, I will see y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow's my uh, solo day to get out and explore a little bit of Knoxville, so that'll be fun because he has to work a little bit, so. Yeah, I'll see you in the morning. woke up kind of I've been kind of lazing around so today's the day that I get to explore by myself I'm gonna find somewhere to go get some coffee I know yesterday when we were going to Starbucks to get my little freebie birthday drink um, we saw some like coffee shops that were around this area so I want to go get a coffee I want to go see the women's suffrage um, memorial down there because that looks really cool so I'm gonna get some clothes on I'm gonna pop out there get some coffee when I say coffee I mean chai I'm not actually getting coffee so let me find a cool little coffee shop I love Yelp Yelp just gives you everything everything you need let's see ooh Mahalo coffee roasters Old City Java. Now this looks like a cool little coffee shop. Let's see if they have a, a chai. They better have chai. They have a dirty chai latte, which means they have a non-dirty chai latte. <laughs> Let me put some real clothes on. Let's go get a coffee. So where I'm going decided to take me through Market Square. So looked at the women's suffrage statue. Some other cool stuff back there. The bell. So now we're going to Old City Java, I think is the name of it. So it's only like a nine minute walk, so it's not too bad. We walked through here yesterday, so it's pretty nice outside. 
I'm not hot yet, but it's gonna be like 72 today, which is lovely. So, yeah. there was a guy that was just riding by on his bike that was telling all the girls he passed to make sure we get out and vote today because today's the primaries, but I'm not in Durham, so sadly, I can't vote and I didn't vote early because I'm a dummy. So. City Java Ooh, in this chair, and I got hot chai latte with honey and caramel. She is full. Oh my god, it's freaking amazing. Mm -hmm. And a prosciutto and something croissant. I forget. Yeah. Looks good. Mm-hmm. It's good. y'all that was one of the best chais i've had in such a long time delicious so now walking up a hill but now i'm gonna stop at proper popcorn before i head back and figure out what else i want to do today these parking spaces right here and it says back and only and I wonder why it's interesting all right so I'm back and now I'm just gonna sit and relax oh let me show you uh, the popcorn that I went and got. So I stopped in. I got me black cherry soda. I got Ooh. this was their small bag by the way. A small caramel corn. A I think this was like a snack one. God this is big. Snack uh zebra drizzle. Um, trying to grab it. Ooh, definitely, definitely white cheddar popcorn. Favorite. Love white cheddar popcorn. And then I think they call this a pint size, and this is their cookies and cream. So, yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and chill because I really do love this room. That's it. I like this room. I wanna chill. And I've been walking around for a good bit, so. All right, so chilled, took a shower and a bath. And now I'm gonna go find some food. There's a sushi place that's down here uh, that I wanna try. So I need to finish this video that's gonna go up at some point because I've been lazy this week because it's my birthday week. So hopefully it will go up tomorrow morning. But yeah, let's go get something to eat and enjoy this weather because it's beautiful outside. So, so I'm loving these like, giant plantation set shutters so let's head out since hank is still doing some work
back got Hank and now we're gonna walk down to this spot that I saw earlier that said like it's not a food hall but it said something kind of similar so that's where we're gonna go something smells good I think there's also shopping so check out today it's so sad but stick around because I'm gonna split this up into two videos because we're going somewhere after this because I'm doing a full-on birthday week but I woke up to rain and it's beautiful you know I love me some rain so also as I'm standing here at the window I realized I mean the the plantation shutters are pretty good at blocking out light but they also have let me see this string right here but if you wanted to make it completely black out, you can put the stain down. So, that's pretty cool. Let me put this back up though, because I like being able to wake up to the sunlight. So, Now I'm gonna sit here, finish uploading this video, and uh, take one last bath before we head out. But yeah, it's so nice outside. Oh. It's always sad to leave, it's bittersweet. It's like you're always ready for the next adventure, but I don't know, it's still sad. It's still just so sad. All right, took my bath, shower, all the things. Now we're checking out. This room was beautiful, grand. So let me make sure I'm not leaving anything because when we switched from the last room to this room, I left one of my body scrubbers. They found it, they found it. But I need to take this out because I used it. Robes were amazing. All right, all the towels. I think bathroom is, oh. tub, tub is great. A little small, but it was still great. Honestly, all right. What made this stay absolutely the best was the staff. The staff was great. All right, it's empty. I have such a fear of leaving stuff that like, uh, I check, 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 check. But, the staff was great. Like they were just everybody that we interacted with here was amazing. Right, Jesse? Wouldn't you say the staff was like amazing here? Every single person we talked to was just great. It was great. So we're gonna go check out. There's a, a coffee shop I want to stop at before we hit the road. We have like a 
like a three hour drive to our next destination so make sure you uh keep watching for that one but yeah <sighs> get the coffee check out Remedy coffee. It was a very like cool person coffee shop. <laughs> Everyone was just like, what do you want? Okay, that's fine. The girl in there had this really cool hat. She looked like Louise <laughs> from Bob's Burgers. And she was like, you're the second person who's told me that. I was like, well, it's cool. I like it. <laughs> it's a cool person coffee shop. It's not made for us olds, I guess. Anyway, I got us youngs. I'm also young. I'm 32. Uh, let me try my hot chai with oat milk and vanilla and caramel syrup. Delicious. It's very sweet. I probably could have gone with just one of the syrups. This is very sweet. Try your a latte. How's your a watte? Mine's a chai watte. Is it good? Yeah. Better than the hotel coffee? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, so now last stop before we head out and it is like pouring is Calhoun's Calhoun's barbecue Calhoun's Barbecue, barbecue. barbecue. Jesse saw something on there that had uh, bacon wrap burnt ends Sounds like a heart attack waiting to happen, but we're probably gonna get it anyway. If we split it, it'll be fine That's hate. Yeah, all right on our way All right, so the food looks freaking amazing. So you want to try these burnt ends first? Sure. Bacon wrapped burnt ends, right? Yeah. All right, cheers. Oh my God. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. Good. What are you thinking? <clears throat> it's pretty good, though. It's pretty good. It's pretty delicious. Look at that. Oh, about to drop it. If I drop it, I promise you I'm going to eat it. Mmm. Oh, hot. So, we each get three of those. Just so you know. Oh, yeah. Just so you know. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Alright, I'm going to try my sandwich and then we're going to hit the road because I want to have my chai because it's nice and hot, so it's a really good fry. That's like when Cookout used to have seasoned fries, that's what it tastes like. Remember when Cookout used to do seasoned fries? And they do Cajun fries. Cajun fries. I feel like they used to call them seasoned fries. And then they went to Cajun fries. I've called them Cajun fries for as long as I've done the cookout. Well, I always called them seasoned fries, so that doesn't mean that's what they're supposed to become. Yeah. Alright, let me get a fork. Let's try this coleslaw, because I'm very excited for my coleslaw. Thank you. <laughs> that's a big old thing, of slaw. Mmm! First off, I'm try a bite of the sandwich. I should put some barbecue sauce on it though, because I'm trying to have a sandwich without barbecue sauce. Okay, okay, okay. Mm-hmm. 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 Hank got the brisket sandwich. So, I mean, we know the brisket's good because we just had the brisket burn in. So, absolutely delicious. I'm glad we stopped here because I was like, we didn't have any like barbecue in Tennessee. So now we have. 
And now we have. Mm -hmm. Okay. One more bite of slaw, cause I love coleslaw. Um, I hope you enjoyed our Knoxville vlog. We didn't do a whole whole bunch, but what we did, I mean, we enjoyed it. I had fun. And now we're off to our next adventure. So definitely watch next week so you can see where we go, what we do, of course what we eat. And you know there's probably going to be a soaking tub in there. So, because <laughs> I'm obsessed with them. But anyway, if you watch all this way, I appreciate you. And uh, consider subscribing. Stick around. See where we go. What we do. Have a good one. Bye, y'all. <laughs>